I thank you, Rick. Well, the firestorm over Hartford County Delegate Marianne Lasanti will not die down. The House censored her yesterday, and now some want her expelled. And WJZ investigator Mike Elgren is live at the House office building in Annapolis with the new developments. Mike? And Denise, the Senate is going to take up the issue next week. On Monday, the committee that deals with ethics there will discuss Lasanti. It is clear that she is not willingly going to leave her post. I'm a Christian. In every bad thing, there is a light. After being censured by her peers and battled, Harford County Delegate Marianne Lasanti continues to change her story and make excuses. Now claiming she never referred to Prince George's County as an N word district. It is apparent that some in attendance heard or thought they overheard an inappropriate word. It's starting to become lies. But Delegate Jay Walker says he was at a bar with her in January, and there's no question he heard her use a racial slur. She says it was alleged. It wasn't alleged. I was there. It wasn't alleged. So she needs to apologize to my district, to Prince George's County, and to the state. She's basically a lame duck delegate. Delegate Daryl Barnes leads the Legislative Black Caucus. When she spoke before the Legislative Black Caucus, she said, yes, I have used these words before. But the two-term Democrat refuses to leave her job. You don't, you don't walk away from crisis. You, you roll up your sleeves and you get involved. You bring the community together. Her office door was closed when we stopped by. Where is the contriteness? This is an egregious act of racism. Many are comparing her to Virginia's governor, Ralph Northam, who first admitted he dressed in blackface, then changed his story, saying he was not in this yearbook photo. This is not Virginia. <laughs> we are Maryland. This is not just going to stop at this news cycle. We are here to stay. Lasanti says she wants to visit Prince George's County. Delegate Walker says she can stay home and step down. Well, if you didn't do anything, why do you want to come to Prince George's County? Lasanti has been stripped of her leadership roles. New at 5 will talk to a woman who voted for her several times about why this is so painful. Live in Annapolis, Mike Helgren, WJZ.